In a historic move Sunday, Pope Francis publicly displayed what are believed to be bone fragments from St. Peter for the first time since they were discovered almost 75 years ago. Pope Francis brought out the case holding the relics and later displayed them at Mass Sunday. The remains thought to be those of the man recognized as the first pope were actually discovered during an archaeological dig at St. Peter's Basilica back in 1939. It wasn't until almost 30 years later when Pope Paul VI publicly said the fragments were identified as St. Peter's in a manner which we believe convincing. Convincing, but not completely sure. That's because researchers weren't able to completely confirm they were from St. Peter. Some Vatican archaeologists don't believe the bones are really those of the apostle. No papal leader has ever definitively declared the remains belong to St. Peter. Whether the fragments are St. Peter's remains a mystery, but CNN reports it's widely believed the first pope was crucified in the year 64 AD and was buried in Vatican City. The bone fragments that were displayed Sunday are normally held in an urn inside the Vatican. For Newsy, I'm Zach Toombs.